Ha fatto tanto intro, troppo, troppo. Pensavo troppo. Cristo, eh. Cristo, 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 Enjoy the most is is and what I find amazing is 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 Nausa mm -hmm. and, and overall the Sinoma grow great. If you uh, you know as I did, if you visit Nausa and when I visited the first time, I was in my mid twenties uh, and and just fell in love with the people and fell in love with the region and saw again a uniqueness of Greece that almost has been lost. It's sort of like has withstood the test of time and it's and it just and you just sort of find yourself in an area that has been doing the same thing for, for thousands of years and, and, and it, it's mesmerizing and, and, and enchanting to see and to see the passion of these people fighting against, again, economic odds to keep going and to make vintage after vintage and, and Xinoma Rosa grape is, is not the easiest grape to, to cultivate. I mean, it's, it's, it's a fickle grape um, everybody tries to make Sinoma wines, but very few people master it. It has high tannins, has high acidity. It's temperamental, but when you do it right and you and it's and you taste it at its perfection, it's it's like no other. I mean, it it will literally blow away any Nebbiolo or or Barolo or Barbaresco. Um, and it's just a, you know, a small little unknown grape in the northern mm -hmm. part of Greece in the Macedonia region. So these are things that, that are fascinate me. And to see small producers like Argatia, Kokimos, Taralas, uh, even wineries that, that we don't represent, Dalamaras, Caridas, Pigasos, I mean, the, and, and to see what they're doing and see the work that they're doing is impressive. And then when you get to taste and, and travel around Nausa in the, in the vicinity and go to restaurants like you know, Mairemata or some other villages outside of, outside of Nausa where you taste just the local cuisine and you're impressed. And to be able to be in the middle of the mountains in the wintertime, snowing outside and you're drinking Sinomagro <sighs> and having you know, baby goat or something like that, that's, these are, these are memorable moments that cannot be forgotten. And, and, and to be able to take these moments and to take this region and, and to pass it on, to showcase it to the world is really what's fun and impressive. And this is what makes my job somewhat easier and, and, and a lot more it's, it's funner. Hey, so the girls are there. Not all of them. So can I not be able to do it? Come on, come on.